thank you so much for coming back, doing something that I haven't done in a long time, and I'm really excited about this. I've been looking at this at the arcade, Gateway 26. Bob and I go down there and play the games. I've told you before that we go down there, and it's much better than the city. We lose a lot of money, and then we get prizes for like 900 coins or something like that. We get 900 coins, we go buy a prize. So that's what this is, and that's where we get a lot of our mystery surprises. They're coin pushers, they give tickets, you go redeem a prize. So this is what we've got this time. It's called Na 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 Surprise. I've been looking at this all season, and it's just so cute and so pretty. Now I just went and did what I normally do before I open up one of these and went to YouTube. And guess what? I am so thankful. You're supposed to blow this up with confetti. We're not doing that. So that's like a little disclaimer. We bought this. This isn't being sponsored. This isn't being gifted to us. So I am going to tell you now, I'm editing out the balloon popping part. They said on YouTube there's another way to open them up. Great. So they said, isn't it pretty? And this is like series two. And that diamond means something. I have no idea. The other the other ones had a star and all that on it. And that's a little sticker. But this little girl is so cute. Look at that. Alright. So, like I said, it's a beautiful pink. Completely mystery. You can't tell at all. What it's supposed to be is a plushie with a baby inside. Pretty cool. And instead of doing the 27 minute video that I watched, I am just going to do it quickly the way I would do it. They said this should just pop right open. Right open. Not on the tape. This actually is a pain in the butt, but it's better than going and getting scissors, which I still might have to go get. Okay, there's enough of it open. I can get it out. Here's the straw that they were talking about. Bob's got the camera, so I'm going to have to get this straw out myself to show you the straw I'm not going to use. Ugh. Oh, it's one of them anti-turtle ones. Okay, so here's our surprise. I don't know about our checklist. We'll open this up and, uh... Oh, great. There's like nine different little things about it. I'm not going to go into like one is English and one is every other freaking language. So, here we have some ears. A round bottom. And we got to make sure we don't hit the confetti part. I don't know how that's supposed to happen. Okay. All right. You're supposed to put the straw in here. Okay. Now, I'm not going to rip it back out, but it blows up into a cute little kitty, and I think all the confetti is right here. I can feel it. So, we're going to edit that part out and not blow it up. But that's what it would look like right before you blow it up. So, we're not going to blow it up. We are going to instead rip it apart like the animal I am. Okay. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Lots of stuff in here. Okay, we have, okay, blind bags. That's soft. Oh, good, more paperwork to read. Okay, real quick, let's see what this is. Oh, okay, this is who you can possibly get. Who do we want? Oh, I want that one. I, ha I have to have that one. Or that one. 
I don't want that one or that one. They look ordinary. Okay, so let's see what we're going to get. You're going to get the green one. I want a green one! Okay, here it comes, here it comes. Ooh, and another blind bag. Which I think is a pair of shoes. They said that online. So, yep. She's in there, whoever it is. Little little kitty cat. Little thing. Yeah. So you can put it on your book bag or your purse. And then this also turns out to be like a little purse itself. Okay, here we go. What did we get? What did we get? Okay, we got some more plastic. You guys know I'm not a fan of the garbage. But I guess that's what you need to do. Now, that's completely different than the video. They didn't say that at all. Extra plastic. That's what kept the little bunny face nice and cool and neat. So without it, that's sort of disappointing to a child. But I think maybe you're supposed to put all the stuff in there. Okay, so I don't know if I crushed this one myself. Okay, here we go. We'll find out who we got. Okay. All right, who did we get? Fishnet girl. Let's see. We didn't get the, the one girl, but here we go. She's got purple hair. Who is she? Okay, we got... Oh, my God, that's so funny. It's Catherine Whiskers. It's Catherine Whiskers. And just like the YouTube thing said, it's got that nice little hang tag that's holis holistic. What is the word? Holographic. Holographic. And this is a real doll. Feel that. Mm-hmm. It's a real doll. She's naked. I think... No, she's got little panties and stuff on. She's got this cute little hat. Purple hair. I think she's just a regular fine. I'm not sure. I don't care. Let's find out about the clothes that she's got to wear. Because she got fishnet stockings on. I don't know. What... Yeah, she's a little whore doll. Little dolls. Oh, my God. She's got them big Steve Madden shoes. Remember them, girls? The Steve Madden shoes in the 90s? Claude Hoppers. Yeah. Great big shoes. The girls with big heads. Here's her little shoes. Yeah, shoes. Okay, and our last piece. Let's see. It's soft. I think it's a tutu or a dress. Two things show up in here. Oh, that's cool. Yes, this is a tutu. For those who don't know, a little tutu goes around the waist like a little dress. Wow, this is really worth it. I'm glad we didn't pay the $30 for it. I wouldn't be so sad if I got it for like Christmas for like my goddaughter or something like that. But for 30 bucks, I don't know about the 30 bucks to be honest with you. Okay, so then she's got that on and then the world's smallest little t-shirt that says I love cats. Well, guess what? It goes on the top part right there. And somewhere in the mix, I'll put it on there later and show it to you. So that's what we ended up with. That was really, and the hair is really nice. I'll take all our hang tags off. That just says she came through customs in Canada and all that crap. So for all that trash, we got a really cute box that actually has to be destroyed. A real doll. This is not plastic. This is almost like... It's stuffed. I don't know how to explain it to you, but it's it's cloth over top of like a plastic. It's nice. It's not vinyl. You might even be able to get dirty if you're carrying it around. So she doesn't have a home other than the bunny head or the kitty cat head. I think she's supposed to stay in there. That's the end of that. She doesn't stay in there very well. So that's that. All that trash, and we got a pretty cool doll. I don't really know what they think kids are gonna do with this. Maybe put some crap. Book it on your book bag. Yeah, book bag. Their purse. This is really pretty. I gotta put my cat's toys in it. It's kind of a hoarder. Yeah, it's trash. All right, peace. Na na na, surprise.